All right, guys, I want to talk to y'all about Stephen A. Smith and a former ESPN host. She came out and she has spoke out against Stephen A. Smith. She stood with Max Kellerman and she also stood with Marcellus Wiley comments on Stephen A. Smith. And you know, when I was doing this video, I thought about a recent clip that I had made about Stephen A. Smith when I had covered him and his whole Marcellus Wiley, Max Kellerman thing. When Stephen A. Smith has said this about Marcellus Wiley and Max Kellerman's relationship, he said he wished he had a friend like Marcellus Wiley. Let's check that out right here. What I do want to say is this. A couple of things. The individual who he felt the need to come to the protection of, that's his best friend. So guess what, Marcellus Wiley? I wish I had a friend like you. Actually, I'm lying. Because I already have friends like you. I've got a bunch of friends that will come to my aid. Just like you came to the aid of our former colleague. Who, by the way, is a former. He'll always be a colleague because he'll be back in the business doing his thing. But that's neither be here nor there. Okay, and the reason why I want to highlight that in today's video, because it's going to put things into context for me. When he has said that, you see, he kind of like thought about it and then he had to check himself and say, oh, I do got friends like that. And I think that was just a bullshit, flat out lie, in my opinion. And the reason why I say that is because you don't really see too many people coming out and defending Stephen A. Smith. Think about like somebody like Dan Lepitard, pretty much against Stephen A. Smith, right? Because of what him and Skip Bayless did the sports television. And when Dan Lepitard is reporting a lot of the stuff surrounding Stephen A. Smith, it's really not in favor of Stephen A. Smith. So I'm thinking like, man, you know, there's not really too many former colleagues that's coming out and defending Stephen A. Smith when you actually really sit there and think about it. So when Stephen A. Smith tried to check his ego real quick and then he said he has friends that will defend him, it's just like, where do you see that at? Because I did a video covering how Jenny Taft stood with Shannon Sharp and the whole Skip Bayless thing. That video has almost 500,000 views. And to this day, you still see Jenny Taft and Shannon Sharp embracing and acknowledging each other when they see each other in passing like they did at the Colorado game when they was all supporting Deion Sanders. So in today's video, I want to talk about Michelle Beadle, former ESPN host. She hosted alongside Colin Cowherd. So Michelle Beadle resume speaks for itself. She also used to host Get Up on ESPN as well. So yeah, with that being said, let's get into the comments Michelle Beadle made about Stephen A. Smith and Max Kellerman. Here's Be sure to hit that like button for me if you haven't already. That helps this YouTube channel continue to grow. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, stay up to date with all of my current YouTube videos. Peace. Look, a lot of things happen behind the scenes on those types of shows, a lot of things. And all of us know so much. Uh, I know that if I just picked up the Twitter right now and decided to say a bunch of stuff that I know has happened, it would be a lot of attention gained, but what's, I don't want that kind of attention. And I think in this particular case, that's what we're looking at. I, I think he's wrong. I think Max was a, a good sparring partner. Um, I think what Marcellus had to say about Max being very, very intelligent, and maybe that's just not what was being craved for an opponent probably is closer to the truth than anything. Okay, and if you guys want to go check out the full clip of that, I'll have the link down below to Awful Announcing Podcast YouTube channel. He has more clips and more videos with Michelle Vito, so I really suggest that you guys should go over there, check it out, go subscribe up to the channel, give his videos some likes as well, man. Go support Awful Announcing Podcast. So go over there, check them out. Don't forget to hit the like button on this video. Hit that subscribe button as well, and I'll catch you guys on the next video, and we out, guys. Peace.